Uh, for this screencast, I'm going to be doing number 19 from 13.4. Uh, what I ask you to find is the equation of the plane that is contained, or that is given by the three points listed here. Um, so what we're, what we're going to want to do is find vectors using the points, and then using two vectors, take the cross product to find a uh, no normal vector here. So we're going to find the two vectors. So I found the uh, first vector, which I labeled A, or vector V. Um, so I just took the uh, basically the slope of each and put it into each of the unit vectors here. So as you can see, there's no actual uh, change in K. So that just remains 0. So the vector is I plus 3J. And now I'll just do vector B real quick, which will actually be, um, as you can see, we're going to use it with the origin, which it will just end up being 2i plus 4j plus k. Because we'll call this one w. So if you look at the diagram now, we've found this and this. So now all I have to do is take the cross product of those two uh, to get that right there. So I'm going to write this out in using the magnitudes of each of the i, j, and k to make it just easier to do the cross product. 3, 0. All right, from here we take the cross product, which I remember it just using kind of memorization. But um, it ends up being v2 to w3, and I'll write this out. So it's all of that right there. So now we just have to run through it and some really fun algebra. So when you match them all up and multiply and plug it all in, this is what you get. So from here it's 3i minus j. Oh, never mind, that'll end up being negative. Um, negative 2k equals your normal vector. Now with normal vector, we can plug this into the equation of the plane, which ends up, which is, which is this. And what's really nice about this problem is one of the points that we're given is the origin. So you, it cr crosses out all these knots here, these x, y, and z knots. So literally, the only thing you have to do is replace the i's and the j's in the normal vector with x's, y's, and z's. So the equation of the plane is 3a minus, oop, that was completely wrong. I don't know why I said that. What is actually is 3x minus y minus 2z equals 0. And that's the equation of the plane that goes through those three points right there. And I believe that is all.